Adding this rotating wheel effect to your slides will make your presentation appear more structured and will certainly impress your clients. Creating these slides is not complicated. Follow my channel, bookmark the videos, and I will teach you how to do it. First, let's create the wheel. In the built-in shape library, find a rectangle and a hollow circle. Insert them onto the slide and align them center. Next, select them, go to Shape Format, find the Merge Shapes function, and choose Subtract. Rotate the shape, hold down the Shift key while resizing proportionally, make sure to hold Shift to prevent it from becoming an ellipse. Next, let's enhance the wheel. Add a shadow effect to the shape, select the shadow in the center, set the transparency to 30%, and blur to 40. Set it to no line. Now our rotating wheel is ready, set it aside for now. Insert the prepared image, cut it to the clipboard with Ctrl plus X. Set the PowerPoint background, choose picture or texture fill, select clipboard, and the background will be set to our prepared image. Then, add a gradient mask to make the image more textured. Insert a rectangle, set it to gradient fill, remove the two stops in the middle. Choose black for both stops, Set around 40% transparency for the left side and 100% for the right side. Set it to no line. Now our background is done. Copy the completed rotating wheel to the slide and position it near the middle. Set the wheel fill to slide background fill. This completes the first slide of the PowerPoint. Duplicate this slide with Ctrl plus D. Set a different image as the background for the second slide. Rotate the wheel counterclockwise to align with the second wheel area. Repeat the same process for the following slides. Next, add corresponding text to each slide and let the text animate. On the first slide, copy the text from the second slide and place it below the image. On the second slide, move the text from the first slide above the image and then copy the text from the third slide to place below the image. Repeat this process for the subsequent slides, copying the text from the previous slide to place above the image on the next slide, and the text from the next slide to place below the image on the previous slide. Finally, select these slides, go to the transition options, and find the versatile morph effect. Click Preview. And you have created a visually appealing and practical wheel transition effect. If you like this effect, please try it yourself. Feel free to subscribe to my channel.